What's up guys, Ayovo here, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to remove the background noise from your audio recording using Audacity. So the first thing you want to do is go ahead and open up Audacity and then record the audio. Now keep in mind that when you record the audio, you want to have a bit of silence at the beginning or the end so that you can have just a chunk of that background noise on its own. So as you can see, I'm recording the audio and then I left a bit of uh, silence at the very end. And once you record the audio, what you want to do is align everything and edit it as you would. So as you can see, I'm going to be using the time shifter tool so that I can move both of the audio recordings onto one channel like so. And now what I'm going to be doing is using the select tool to just remove any unwanted um, space in the recording so that everything is all together. And you can do this by highlighting all the blank space and then pressing Control X. Now, once you do this, you're going to have just the audio clip you want to edit. And to remove the noise, what you want to first do is highlight that you know, that space or that background noise that you left on its own at the beginning and then go to effect and then get noise profile. Basically what this is doing is allowing Aud Audacity to know what the background noise is so that it can remove it later on. So once you get that background noise selected, you want to select everything by pressing Control A and then you want to go to effect, noise removal once again and then press OK and what this should do is remove all the noise. It should remove that background noise that you selected before throughout the entire recording and your audio should sound a lot better now. And what you can also do is add other effects such as you know changing the pitch or changing the speed of your recording. But other than that, you should be good to go. And what you can do is go ahead and save the recording if you're going to be editing it again. And if you want to use it in your videos, all you have to do is go to File and Export and save it as whatever you want. It'll save as a .wav and you can use it in your videos. So that's about it. If you guys like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. And as always, thanks for watching. My name is Ayogo and I'm signing out.